friends uh, good morning welcome back thanks for uh, supporting my channel so today we are going to learn how to create the stacked area chart so this is how it will look like so i'll delete it and i'll uh, teach you how to make this kind of chart this is very interesting so please uh, watch the full video so this is my table which where i have the months and i have different categories of expenses and also i have shown how the expenses are increasing or decreasing over a period of month or in a month where my money exactly goes and how I distribute my expenses among these many categories. Okay, so without wasting more time, let us create the chart. So I'll select my data set. So I'll not take total because total automatically comes in the chart. So I'll select the month and also the categories. I'll click on insert. Then I'll click on recommended charts. Now you can see uh, Excel automatically shows me the relevant chart. So I'll select the stacked area chart. So under stacked also there are multiple stacked charts. Today we are talk going to talk about the stacked area chart. So what exactly stacked area chart does? So with the help of stacked area chart, we understand how much we distribute for a particular category out of the whole. So let me explain you from this particular example. So look at the month of November. In the month of November, I can see there are different colors. Each color represent different categories. So I can analyze in the month of November, how much did I spend on a particular category and each category is stacked on one other and also it is represented by different color so i can see out of the total expenditure of november month how much i spent on dining table how much i spent on sofa how much i spent on bed basic system refrigerator television so on and so forth so this chart is visually attractive and also easy to understand and like i explained yesterday we also can add the data label to this chart we also can add a table to this chart also we can format this in different ways so whatever i select it will be reflected here so we can play with the design and whatever is visually attractive to our eyes we can keep that also we can change the color so you can see this entire range is for all my categories i can select a different range I can select different colors and whatever I like, I can keep that. So hope uh, this, all, this was useful for you and uh, let me know if you have any question, you can comment on my YouTube channel or uh, you can also comment on the Facebook and uh, let me know if you have any questions or if I can help further on this particular topic. Thank you very much for watching this video.